Hello, my friends. My name is Unky, and welcome back to another episode of my time at Sand Rock. I, well, we have a big fireside chat today to find out what's going to happen with our hopefully de desertification of the desert. Sounds so terrible when you say it that way, right? It's like we're destroying the desert. You, will you please use the toilet? These are a mess. Hello, cutie. <laughs> the fact that um, they do a little dance for me brings me so happy. Still growing 70%. So um, energy 100%. Um, if you want to sell, no, why would I? I would never, I would never sell. We'll never ever sell. Okay, let's see what's going on over here. Oh, look, it's Heidi. Heidi. Heidi and Elsie. My pa stayed up all night jamming on that keyboard. Whoa, we're good friends. But then put an iron bar in the blender this morning. Ruined the dang thing. Remember to always get eight hours of sleep, Builder. Going without rest does things to you. Well, that's the damn truth because I never get enough sleep and my brain is scrambled. Okay, see well, ya. we should go on a play date with Haiti soon enough. Let's check the mail, see what's going on over here. From Haiti, <laughs> okay. Hey, I don't know if you saw the newspaper, but well, I lost. Oh, well, that's too bad. Verna put me in last place even. I guess she took my decision personally. Don't worry, I'm not too beat up about it. I have a feeling we'll be able to use the design here in Sandrock sooner or later. Still a win in my book. Oh my gosh, I love her indomitable spirit. It brings me so much joy. So much joy, we'll have to take her on a play date soon. And hang out, we are good friends now. That's so cool, that's so cool. Let's take a look at this actually. Um, good friends with Haiti. I don't think it unlocks another outfit. I do love this outfit a lot, so I'm gonna put that one on her. Um, and she likes water and she likes opals. We should find something else that she likes too. I think, do, did my diamonds end up in my chest? Let's take a look. Actually, I'm super curious. Fluorite, there we are. We have 11. Let's give her a diamond. What do you say? Can we split this? Uh, open functions menu, split. We don't want to give away too many and get crazy. Let's say sort all. Okay, but it does put it away. That's right. Let's not forget that. Oh, wait. Oops. Split. Confirm. We'll take it. There we go. Oh, and we did talk about upgrading these. Didn't we make these bars over here? Manganese bars so that we could upgrade them. I'm pretty sure we did. How are we doing over here on the ore refinery? Furniture, large storage box. Here we go. So we just need latches. Oh, well that's easy enough to make. Where do we make the latches? Is it here as well? Or do those things we have to find? I can't remember off the top of my head. Well, here I can look at it. Civil grinder, civil recycler. Okay, well we'll make two to start. Uh, I don't need to make those. Iron latch, steel bar. Uh, we'll make four. I don't know if that will get us to where we need to be, but I'll take it. I'm in, okay. Uh, hopefully the audio is okay. Oh, we need to get straw. We have to go by and get straw today. Pokey, you're insane. Get out of the freaking, uh, we still have these to open up. Let's open them up. Fiber mesh, fiber mesh, microchip. Okay, nice, nice. Sort. We have these pictures to hang. We have to go install this. So we have some chores to do today. That's kind of fun. Where are these? Okay, we have two of them. Let's look at maybe upgrading the most crappy ones first. Farming, cooking. This seems like a good one to upgrade. There we go. What do we got here? Refined goods. Relics too. Okay, we definitely want to upgrade the relics one. Don't we? I guess we'll do relics two first because we are just stuffed with relics right now. We have so many. So let's take a look. See how much space it made. So much space. I love this. Okay, where are all my excess relics? Let's just get them in here. I have three of those. That's a lot. I guess we could technically call the armor display piece one that's cool. Uh, conch shell statue, nay. This will hang on to a uh, camera that can go there. Sort all, uh, uh, cancel, we're gonna say sort. Now let's take a look at 
ore and gems. This one's full, but we have more. So we could actually... Which is the other one that we upgraded? Farming, cooking? Yes, we can put a bunch of this stuff in here, right? I mean, we could even do the do. I have 96 data disks now. That's great. What is this? It says it's a resource. I'm just kind of hanging on to it because, because. I really hate these rocks. I hate these rocks. Oh, look, the duplication glitch is still here. Or did I just swap it out? I don't really know. Whatever. It's not that big of a deal. As long as I have enough space. Okay, so... Do we have the bloodstone? We don't have the clay. That's our problem. We need clay. We need clay. Okay, so there's some resources we need. We need clay and we need hay. Let's go get both of those things. We'll turn in the hookah parts in a minute, but let's go get the hay first. Pretty sure we get that from uh, old Zeke pants down here. We'll buy a ton of it so that we don't have to worry about messing with the straw grid much anymore. Bert. Bye. I am super curious if you can hunt these rabbits. I should try. It seems terrible. Seems terrible shooting a sweet, innocent little bunny. Hey, here we are. We'll buy it all. Anything else we want to buy? I don't think so. I think that I'm quite happy with the things that I have right now. Okay. Come, my yak. Oh, fireside chat tonight. I'm very excited about it. I cannot wait to hear what the progress is. I can't wait, honestly, I can't wait to hear what insane rude nonsense comes out of Cooper's mouth about it. He's such a jerk. <laughs> algae, you think we're all gonna eat algae? I'd rather die. I'll just starve right now. <laughs> Something insane, he's so rude. Okay, okay, okay. Let's buy a pile of clay so we don't have to think about it. We are definitely flush with cash again. And um, hello, Amira. Not that much, actually. 120. Oh, look at this. Look at this. She's got even better stuff. And we could definitely buy her cool wares. She gave us that one. I mean, the defense is really, really nice. Uh, can we get a Haiti figurine, please? Good friends with Haiti will come with the bonus of uh, not having to spend so much at the construction junction, which is really nice. Let's see what other commissions we can acquire. I think it's two a day, but maybe if we have two on us... Let's see. We, oh my God, this canvas order is getting out of control. Okay, so I might have to take one of these. And now they don't need any desert. I know that I have these, so this wouldn't be too hard to do. It's not a lot of money. I have none of the cantaloupe. I definitely don't have any of this stuff. I'm gonna do this one just to get it out of here. Well, I'm tempted to try this one. It is good money. I'll do the unsure one. I have too many. How dare you. Okay, well, let's go give um, Mabel her hookah parts, and then we'll come back and we'll grab that. Hey, bud. Confirm. Thank you. That'll do nicely. All right, and then looks like we get to find, I can recall, in fact, the first time I came to Sandrock was on my birthday, the sixth of winter. I was riding in a yak milk cart, and wouldn't you know it, Cooper was on the wheel, was at the wheel. He was too shy to talk to me that day. I didn't forget that handsome face of his, ha ha. Handsome, huh? Well, Catch you know you what? You know, beauty is in the eye of the beholder. I don't know that I would call. You know what? Actually, I take that back. I 100% take that back because we've seen the photos of young Cooper and he actually was rather dashing, was he not? 
Let's clean this crap up. I mean, it's just just unsightly to see garbage all over the place. I don't want garbage in my hands, though. Uh, curious to see chromium heavy sword. Cool! Chromium daggers. Ooh, a new pistol? I have to buy this, right? I have to. What else do we have? Steel great sword, steel daggers. I think we can just shoot right past that and get the chromium ones. What do I have? I have iron. I just have these crappy iron ones. We're going to buy this right now. Look at all the money we have. There's no two ways about it. What else do we have? Ooh, oh my goodness, there's a whole outfit here. Desert Warrior. Are we gonna buy this whole outfit? I think we have to. Let's see, do we have the, uh, so this is 2,000, this is 5,000, and yeah. I wanna be a Desert Warrior. What can I sell this dork? I guess I'll sell all these stupid rocks. Take my rocks, please. Uh, we could sell these. We really don't need them. Is there anything else? I have never used these. Are these for setting off fireworks? That is the one Playdate event that we haven't done, and I think that would be really fun to do. Here, let's sell the food scraps. Here you are, garbage man. It doesn't make us a lot of money. We really don't make a lot of money from selling stuff. Okay, cool, we have new quests, new personally assigned quests. Okay, we're gonna try and do this canvas thing. Wait, maybe not actually, because what if I need that canvas for my desert warrior clothes? Oh my gosh, this is so fun. Okay. Choo choo. Oh, I am a desert warrior. I am a desert warrior. Head on home, my sweet, lovely, beautiful beast. Okay, desert warrior, desert warrior. Look at this. We can make this. Okay, so tanned leather, tempered glass. We made all that tempered glass and now chromium bars. Cool. Okay, so what about. What about the rest of it? Desert Warrior shirt. So we need to make a lot more, te look at that, canvas. I am so freaking smart. I am so smart. Okay, where do we make the canvas? Right here. Oh, we make it out of jute and plastic. Okay, well we're gonna make six canvas right now. And we'll let that roll. Now in terms of these chromium daggers, claws from Monsters Commission. Where in the world do I get those? And then Lapis Lazuli. I think we found that out and about just out, like, um, like on the overworld. Oh, those look really cool. They are made of chromium and have a comfortable texture with a tough structure. Uh, nice. Okay, so we're gonna need more chromium bars. Do we have chromium ore? I don't think so. I think I need to make more tempered glass now, don't I? No, it's exactly enough. Amazing. Of course. We did get a bunch of ore. What are we... Oh, these are for our chests. Okay, so what are we missing? We're waiting on... Okay, a bunch of bloodstone. I only get two from each one of these. This is crazy. It should be a lot more, don't you think? Maybe if I upgraded this at one point. Nope, there's no upgrading. I not, might just need to make a bunch. Okay, quick build too. Okay, cool, we can turn that in. Oh my gosh, this is gonna take a long time. Hold on. Before we let that run, um, I gotta see something. Desert Warrior Visor. Okay, we're gonna build this, and then can we build this in addition? Yes, we can. Craft the boots, which one's faster? Well, we're making the boots. We haven't gotten new shoes in a while, so this is very, very exciting. I am thrilled. Let's get as much do as we can. Get out of the food bin. We need to get him a friend. We do, we do. I just Oh, I'm so I'm so thrilled that we're gonna make ourselves a new outfit. We just need to get our hands on what is it, animal claws? We gotta find where it is. I have no idea. We can take a look. Let me see. I'm gonna look it up on the wiki right now. I don't need to just spend like a ton of time just wondering. Is it Desert Warrior shirt? 
No, this will not be that hard to make. Look at this. This looks very, very functional. These pants are cool. What was it? Oh, no, it was for the, um, it was for the, these guys. Duh. Claws. Okay, claws, sadly, my friends, are not something that I can get my hands on until I apparently just progress the main story mission. So maybe I should go back and get the steel claw, um, or steel chromium da steel daggers. I should go get the steel daggers um, recipe. Uh, this is pretty close. Why don't we stop by right here and turn this in? Who is this? Is this Hugo? What a mess. Just leaving his trash everywhere. Nobody has any respect for the desert. Hammer time! Mr. Hugo. Thank you. You know, do you think that he just gives these to... No, wait. What am I thinking? Never mind. We'll just pretend I didn't have a thought in my head at all. Okay, so let's get our hands on some steel dagger recipes. Hopefully we can make them. Uh, well, this was a fun little parkour mission. Where are they? 1700 So we've spent basically all of our money on this. Desert Warrior Cape! 100%. Oh my god, we're building that next. We need a cape. Are you kidding? Of course we need a cape. Um, was there, we only got one out of two. We were going to get that. I guess we'll do the bronze bars for old Burgie over here. Or excuse me, bronze pipes. For our sweet little water boy. Oh my God, I want the cape. I'm going to make the cape right now. We're going to cancel the shoes and make the cape. I am wearing a cape for the rest of my life. That is so cool. Yes. These are my favorite things. I don't know. I don't know how many of you ever played Final Fantasy 16. No, excuse me. Final Fantasy 14. Great game. Wonderful game. Best game. Um, but I spent so much time just playing dress up in that game. It was all I did. Where's my cape? Desert Warrior cape. Okay, so we do need three canvas for this. Oh, it looks cool. Is that a skull? Is that what that is? A strong red cape that complements the Desert Warrior outfit. Turning a cool combat outfit into a true superhero form. Uh, amazing. Okay, well, the shoes are close to being done. Um, and then we'll do the canvas after that, right? That's, that's what we'll do. We won't cancel that and then start that because it's a couple steps. So what are we in need of? We need bronze pipes. I guess we have one, so it only needs four. Okay, cool. Um, we could go turn in these potatoes. I really just want these boots. I want the boots. Um, well, there's no reason to wait. We'll just run out there and put the... Um, we have... How much time do we have? Do we have enough time to head out to the desert really quick? Put down the Yakmal station before... Um, before the fireside chat, I feel like we could probably get away with this. Mm, it's sort of pushing it, isn't it? Well, dang, what am I going to do with my time? Do we have any other quests, any missions? Nope, just give potatoes to this guy. It seems like a push. We'll do it. We'll do it. No, it's too soon. Okay, I'm being... I'm, being indecisive and it's not good. We'll go give um we'll go give old uh old Cooper his potatoes. Just admiring the weather, eh bud? Thank you. Sometimes things ain't as simple as you like, and my animals sometimes just don't want want to give what I need. Anyway, thanks for what are you talking about? Okay, there was something here. Oh, his oh. birthday. Fine weather today, by my estimation. Reminds me of the day I was born. Yep, that's right. 22nd of summer. I remember it like it was supposed to be. What, you don't remember being born? This guy is out of his mind. Must be a rancher thing. Yep, I reckon the clouds were aligned much in the same way that they are today. Which reminds me of an amusing antidote involving a pair of spoons I used to play on. Oh, God, here we go. So long, partner. Hey, we're partners now. That's a good thing. 
300? It only costs 300 to buy a baby yak? Really? Should we do it? Yes. Ah, I got another yak! <laughs> yak milk calf, one. <laughs> okay, hold on. <laughs> that was so easy. I can't believe how easy it was. Where is it? Where did it go? Did it just go straight to my barn? Is that what happened? It doesn't go to my pocket now. It just goes straight to my barn. Well, if that's the case, that is very, very cool. Let's go look. You know, I think we've got ourselves a big old full grown yak that we ride around all over town. Oh, there is two of them. Yes. Yes. Well, my friends, I have another mission for you. Somebody name the sweet yak mail calf. Somebody, somebody in the comments. Somebody, please. I see how many of you watch this video. Um, each video is getting well over 100 views. And I have the same wonderful people commenting every time. This is not a complaint. I love you to death for commenting on all my videos. But somebody who has never commented, who doesn't comment, I dare you. I dare you. Give me a name. The first sweet name that comes to your mind. Name my sweet new yak milk calf, who is now keeping pokey company. <laughs> you are welcome to. It would bring me much joy. Oh, my shoes are done. Okay, let's check out the shoes. Nice. Um, let's see. I wonder if we can actually upgrade those. Let's take a look. You know, we're just going to wear them as fashion, but we might be able to upgrade this, right? Let's see what happens. Uh, nope. Keep the old stats. It was better this way. Well, that's too bad. Okay, so we were going to make canvas next, if I'm not mistaken. Where's the canvas? We're going to need jute. We should have gotten jute when we were over there. Okay, beautiful. Now, let's check them out. Uh, character right here. Fashion shoes. Oh, those are serious. Look at those. Armored. Armored shoes. Those are dope. I love these. They look, <laughs> I like the pants tucked into them. Cool. Cool. Look at my serious desert, desert warrior boots. Oh my gosh. Okay, I do want to see if they are upgradable though. They are. Five lapis lazuli. No, we're not doing that. We're not doing that because we need that lapis lazuli to make something. And that stuff is rare. Rare as it gets. Well, darn it. Um, if we don't have... Hey, let's... Uh, why don't we get out of there <laughs> right over the top? Oh, don't forget... So I thought that the best way to charm the meerkats. Okay, so if we're getting this, do we have new stuff that we can get here? Please tell me that there's new cool stuff we can get here. Nope, it's the same schlock. Wait, no, we can actually buy them now. That is cool, but I would rather make them. It's more fun. It's more fun that way. But wait, can I buy? I could buy canvas here. That's really cool. Uh, we do need two of these. The canvas is rather expensive. Oh, and I am so short on funds now. I am so short on funds that we will not buy anything else. But that is good to know. Oh, look, everyone's uh, messing. So I thought that the best way to charm these animals was to give them meat. No, they like fancy stuff. They like diamonds just as much as the next person. Uh, did not we say that we were going to give Heidi? Hey there. Hi. My pa was yapping again the other day. Relationship, relationship, relationship. I swear, it's the only thing on his mind. I mean, you gotta be close with someone before going there, right? I agree. Wouldn't you say that we're close? Just a thought, just a thought. What is me and do it? She had an itch, I guess. <laughs> okay, uh, the fact that she's saying that gives me a little bit of hope. What, by the way, we were just talking about relationships. How about hey, a diamond? That's really nice. A quality gift. Thank you for your generosity. She does not honestly give me the reaction that I kind of want. I wanted to be like, holy crap, you're the most amazing man that's ever lived. And uh, no, she's like, oh, that's nice. We never read this. You know what? If we sit here and read everything that there is to read, we're going to um, just extend this video longer than needs be. I do need to do check one thing. 
Okay, let's get this fireside going. I guess Heidi got bored. Katori, they're patrolling Amira. The ladies of the town are not that interested. Oh, I love that she just stood next to me. I love it. There we go, perfect. Hello, everyone. Glad you could all make it. This'll be my first time presiding over the fireside in a while. <laughs> Hope you can be patient while I shake the dust off a little. <laughs> oh my gosh, her uh, nervousness, while I totally understand, makes me nervous. <laughs> Let's get right into it. So, an update on my anti-desertification efforts. Okay, I just have to say that um, someone in the comments mentioned, like, what if these two are secretly having, like, a rivalry? And and, and I was joking, like, oh, what if Matilda... Because cause she, like, took her desk and wouldn't give it back. Like, what if Matilda just starts stealing her office supplies? I'm sorry, but that look they gave each other, <laughs> it was just like, you are useless, <laughs> is what that said to me. <laughs> This is this is my head cannon now. Is that these two are mortal enemies? There's <laughs> like there's only room. There's only this town's only big enough for one old lady, <laughs> and you ain't it. <laughs> okay, sorry. Moving on. After exploring the previously undocumented shipwreck ruins with the builders and Zeke, we might have stumbled upon an old world solution to our sand problem. So next. I believe Miguel is about to have a serious problem with this. The shipwreck ruins? I'm sorry, when was this? Oh my god, I called it. Here we go, Mr. Uh, dictator himself. Oh, you know, recently. That place is an unexplored hazardous ruins, is it not? It reeks of danger. I'll just come out and say what everyone's thinking. We can't stop you from continuing to put your own life in harm's way or neglecting your official duties, Trudy. But taking both builders, Sandrock would be ruined twice over already without them. Also, to base our future on the potential of a corrupted technology, are you mad? Making such a rash decision was irresponsible and unfitting of the office of mayor. Okay, chill out, bro. I, uh, I... I insisted that we go. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take the fall for this one because I'm not scared of Miguel I at all. appreciate you trying to stick Maybe up for me, Plus five, nice. No, he's right. I acted rashly. No, you didn't. You acted like totally rationally. It was the most in intelligent thing. You found something that could help de-desertify the desert and bring life back to Sandrock and you decided that it was worth the risk. Do I look like a pushover? No, I... I'm about to have a cape. Do you have any idea how tough I am? The entire Come on. purpose of our system of government is to stop the few from going against the will of the many. What can we expect to happen next when our own mayor has no respect for law and order? Who are you to decide what the will of the many is? I hate this guy now. You don't get to decide what the will of the many. The will of the many is to not freaking die. And the town's on the verge of collapse. And yet you would rather just let everyone starve to death because you're scared of some old world technology? This guy's insufferable. Law and order. What law said that we couldn't go explore a shipwreck ruins? That doesn't make any sense. Pastor, please. Can we let her finish? Trudy didn't gather us here just to serve us another help and a bad news. And in the end, here we all are, safe and sound. Thank so you, let's Matilda. Show a bit of respect, shall we? Thank you. I think that Matilda, Matilda's probably done a better job of keeping this guy in line than Trudy has because Matilda has a spine and she's not afraid of people. But I'm sure behind closed doors, Matilda and Miguel had these conversations constantly. And Matilda was just like, shut up and go back to the alt the the podium, all Trudy, right? Trudy, please. Continue. Oh, man. Despite the fact that I'm headcanoning Matilda and Trudy fighting, that was a big thing of Matilda to do just there. Uh, thank you, Matilda. What I want to say is, with Zeke and Director Chi's help, we're using old world technology to develop a viable topsoil for use in the desert. It means we will be able to plant trees into the desert. Real trees. This is huge. This is huge, Miguel. Soon, we plan to test plant a plot of trees near Gecko Station. If it grows, we have a real chance at reforestation. We can make Sandrock green again. We can stop the sandstorms. We can... Uh, we can... 
even stop our decline. This is so big. This would be so exciting if we got to plant trees and grow a forest. How fun! Oh my god, I can't wait. <laughs> I want to be enthusiastic. It's just... It's just what, Owen? It's just what? You can't even, you can't, <laughs> you can't even not take money from your own employee. You're the most backward owner ever. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it from any of you right now. I'm fired up. Yes, yes, we've heard it all before. The same old song and dance. Such hubris. To think nature is something to be controlled. Not controlled, nurtured. Pen. <laughs> Pen. Keeping the town safe. Thank you, Pen. Oh, so you haven't even tested it? And you want to sell us on this? Ha! I knew, okay, so to be fair to people, I knew that this was too early. They should have tested it first and shown that it worked before trying to bring it to everybody. What about the tunnel we talked about, Trudy? Tunny? Tunnel? What tunnel? Well, maybe things are different this time. Thank you, Hugo. A little bit of hope. Um, guys, hello. Tree planting, count me in. Yes, yes. <laughs> Folks, a word. I'm in the same boat as all y'all folks. This is the first I've heard of all this as well. Y'all are right to be skeptical. But when I look into the eyes of our mayor, or as she makes her plea here in front of us all, I see hope. I see light. Okay, maybe I can't really headcanon these two fighting for that much longer. Think about all the harm those sandstorms have done us. How many homes, how many lives have we lost? Oh my gosh, this is what makes Matilda such a great mayor. She knows how to inspire people, right? She's trying to convince people that what she has, she like doesn't even believe in the thing she's trying to sell, whereas Matilda turns this into like a rousing speech. I say, if there's even a one in a hundred, no, one in a million chance that we could make all that go away and bring safety back to our home, why not? Why wouldn't we take that chance? This is our ray of hope. Amen. Who's with me, Trudy? Me. Yeah, let's give it a shot. Attaway, that's my man RVO right I there. Mean, as long as we get to plant trees, I'm down for pretty much anything. You're so sweet, Burgess. You're so sweet. Hmm. Miguel, shut up. Yeah, keep it shut, Trudy? Miguel. I reckon you still got work ahead of you. Tell us what you need us to do. How different would this game be if we were, like, siding with Miguel the whole time? Um, thank you so much, Minister. I have some seeds for black saxel trees with me. Zeke thinks they will grow well in the new Biocrest plot that we're setting up over by Gecko Station tomorrow. Cool. If anyone wants to help us plant the trees, just come up and grab a few from Zeke. You know I'm in. Splendid. I think that about covers it all. I and everyone else await your good news. Meeting adjourned and conserve water. <laughs> Dang, that got kind of heated. Miguel had even me convinced that maybe what we did wasn't such a good idea. Not oh, me. Well, what's done is done. I love Zeke. Take these seeds and plant them near Gecko Station tomorrow. With the hydroponics, you can quickly cultivate a large amount of bio crust. I'll also get some down tomorrow, and you can handle the rest. Here, take some bio crust and wheat straw. Please, take them with you. Why, Just thank take you. take these seeds and plant them in the designated planting area near the Giegler Station tomorrow. To plant faster, you'll need to have a level 2 planting toolkit. Ooh. I have the recipe for it right here. You can have it. Well, thank you. I'll see you tomorrow. Well, thank you. A level two of black saxel seeds. Okay, bio crust. Bio crust is something that I'm sure the game taught us how to make, but I haven't known how to, I do not remember. Uh, Matilda seems to need something. Hmm. Trudy is a fine leader. She just lacks confidence. Folks can smell that. Sometimes it won't matter what you have to say. I'm always happy to lend my voice to her cause, though I'd be more comfortable knowing she could fend for herself. Okay, what do you need? There's are people out there in the desert trying to rebuild after the latest sandstorm. I don't suppose you have a spare rustic dining table to give to the needy. Um, I can look about making that. Okay, let's head on out of here. And a level two planting kit. Let's see, hopefully this doesn't take too much in order to make. I am very, very interested in seeing what this makes. Um, okay, so two canvas. Oh wait, I forgot to tell you to go 
go to bed, my sweet. Return home. We have decided that the number one thing in the world to make is we need one more canvas. One more. How soon? It shouldn't take too long. Let's see about making this planting kit. Bronze stick. Is that here? No, it's throwing bronze pipe. Bronze stick. We're going to say one here. We're going to say two here. Okay, cool. I'm super glad that we can get that done. Two minutes on that one. Uh, I want to start that cape right now. Is there anything else... Oh, look at that. We're missing a steel bar. There we go. One minute, 49 seconds. Okay. Should probably make... I mean, if we're that short on steel bars, we should probably make even more, right? Yeah, we'll make 12 of them. Okay. Let's see. It's 2100 o'clock. I am sort of tempted. Oh, didn't I go get straw? Why don't we do this while we're waiting? Because we just wanted to plant our chestnut, right? There it is. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. How in the world do we make bio crust? This is a question that I have. Let's see. Okay, so after the soil reaches level four in soil quality, that plot will turn into bio crust. This vastly improves soil, allowing you to farm without needing straw grids on that particular plot. And it can safely be dug up and replanted elsewhere on the workshop grounds if you need to move your garden. Okay, that is the answer that I needed. Well, what are we looking at here then? This is still level one. Do we have seeds? Let's see, I could plant actually a little bit of farm land right here, or I could put some down right in front of these folks. What could we grow? Wheat seeds, we could grow some cute cactus seeds. I love it. Maybe more pomato. Um, I think that he gave me straw. I kind of want to save the straw I have. I don't want to um, accidentally, oh my gosh, yes. Okay, cancel. Desert Warrior Cape. Go! Yes! <laughs> so, three minutes and 30 seconds. We'll have to wait until tomorrow. This will be done right now. I want to finish this before we go to bed. Um, let's just use the magic of the internet to fast forward this. Wait, is my steel bar going to be ready? Yes, it is. 15 seconds. Okay, I will see you in 34 seconds. Okay, that's done. I grabbed the steel bar. I actually filled up my water tank while we were waiting. Okay, here we go. Planted. Oh, man, she was spying on me. Did you see that? Quick build. Look at that intermediate planting kit. We nailed it. All right, my friends, tomorrow should be a really, really exciting day. We are going to start building trees, hopefully uh, de-desertify this wasteland. It's very, very exciting. We will also have a cape, at our, <laughs> and we will be well on our way to becoming the superhero that Sandrock needs. I am so excited, and then I'm sure there is all sorts of other fun shenanigans to get into as well my friends thank you for watching until the end hit the like button subscribe leave a comment somebody name yak mel calf too please somebody anybody anybody you don't have to be somebody that hasn't commented before but i think that would be really fun i invite you to throw a name out there it's always it's just delightful other than that i'll bid you all farewell and i look forward to seeing you all next time